Now, we say also, and I want to make this um, as an announcement, that we'd also look at reducing the duty on building materials. Mm -hmm. Certain building materials, because it has to be those building materials that cannot be sourced in the Caribbean. Because if they're coming from the Caribbean, they already come in yes. duty-free. Mm -hmm. And you wouldn't want a situation where you're going to make the, the products that are coming from outside of the Caribbean. Um, you, want, you don't want to create unfair competition yes. and run the Caribbean producers out of business. So we would reduce the cost of duty, but for those items that are not produced in the Caribbean. Building materials, what does that do? That means that the goods and the equipment and materials that you buy that are important in helping to construct your homes and so on, mm -hmm. you'll be able to get a reduced um, price when you buy these things because we would be looking out for the Antiguan and Barbudan consumer, making sure that we can help to ease the squeeze on some of these imported items. And so we'd be looking at building materials. We'd explore what could be done with lumber. Um, obviously, we'd have to make sure that these things are subject to the technical people in the ministry, looking to make certain that these are the best items on which we should select, which we should select in order to create an ease for the people of Antigua and Barbuda. So food items, we believe, are critical. Building supplies, we think, are also very important to help reduce the cost of construction and to help reduce the cost of food so that our people can eat and those who sell food, they can sell the food and still make a little profit. Okay.